Hey, hey, YouTube fam, we're back with a family of seven Aldi grocery haul today. And before we get into that, I realized that while I have kept our Instagram family up to date on what happened with Chris's vasectomy reversal, I have not actually gotten on here and given you guys an update. So it was just finally recently about um, the beginning of May that Chris finally got a good sample result back and he is locked and loaded and he is ready to go. Um, so we are anticipating and hoping that maybe we will be pregnant um, in the very near future with baby six or more yet to be seen. Um, so we we're very happy and excited to get that news finally. It was about almost six months of like just not not good news and a lot of frustration so at least we're good to go finally um but without further ado we are gonna go shop at aldi for our family seven and we have i got all i got all five kiddos with me so it should be interesting I got the cart. Can you help your sisters get unbuckled? Good job, Zeki. What? What? Oh, look at hey. there. Daddy's done with work. So we got backup now. So you should go get another cart. And it'll make it a lot smoother. Do you got a quarter? Uh, yes, I do. Okay. The nice thing about all the carts is they sit two of you. Yeah. Yeah. Two together. Yep. Yep. Let's go shopping. We're going shopping. Oh, Mom, can we get lunchables? I don't know. Hey, Lily. Hi, Joe. Lunchables? Mom, can we get like one of these? Can you put this in here? <laughs> it doesn't go in there. We are going to get some fresh. Produce, so. Fresh produce. Oh, great, great, great. Ch -ch 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 -ch. You want green or you want red grapes? Uh, green. No, I want red. I want red. I want green. I want red. Bit of both. Hey, is this red? Yeah. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, we got a bunch of red grapes. Oh, look, Obviously, this is always better. Um, and then we do stock up on like and dry pantry goods too, but we always start with getting heavy on the fruits and veggies. I love lettuce! Pizza! 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 Do you want pizza? Hold on, bub. Nice job, mama. Good job. Chris skills are gone. Was away Chris for a while. We get chocolate donuts. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, this is part of why I buy the produce organic because then I have my children and my husband pulling me over to the dark side with chocolate donuts. Chocolate donuts. <laughs> How can I resist these faces? You can't. <laughs> All right. Okay. So when it comes to produce, I will typically get at least two of everything just because I don't like grocery shopping and we go through it so fast. It's just easier to stock up. And I, we do have a Costco somewhat near us, about 30 minutes away, it's not bad. 
Um, and I do want to get a membership, but we're working on like reorganizing the house right now so that we have space because I don't have a huge pantry at all. It's basically just another cabinet. And so we're working on converting our coat closet into like more pantry space so I could have back stock so that we could go to Costco and stock up, which would be easier. But for now, we just buy a lot of things at Aldi. Should we get two bags of tortilla chips? Or salsa and hummus? Salsa and hummus? Probably. You know me and hummus. Yeah. <laughs> it's my go-to. Family knows my go-to snack is tortilla chips, hummus, and what they call my bougie water, which is my sparkling water. Um, I like La Croix or La Croix or however you pronounce it, or the other one's like the Bouble. Either one are really, really good. Always gotta get the goldfish, the flavor blasted, are a favorite with our fam, as well as these like peanut butter crackers. And I'm gonna go get, go get the milk. The milky milk. The milky milk. The milky milk. So the much milk. milk. So much milk. The cow milk. You want milk? You want that or that? Um, let's, uh, we'll sure. just, we'll just get the, we'll just get the gallons. We're gonna need six. Six. Six of them. Such a good, affordable breakfast when you're feeding a lot of people. Not that one, Noah. Not that one. Yes, yes because I know you love them. Yes! Just for you for summer, for lunches. Get some of those. Orange juice. And I like to get the protein mix because I feel better about eating it when we have pancakes. And then we're pretty partial to like the real maple syrup it just tastes so good. What is that? What do you have? Dark chocolate sea salt. This is why I don't take you shopping with me. Oh. No, no, I've had it. So when it comes to cereals, I really try to get the ones that limit the sugar, and then I let them pick one that has a little more as like a treat. But most of them are on the lower end. Gotta get three times because I eat. I eat a lot of salad. I do. I love it, especially in the summer. And this is like the best dressing in the whole world. And it sells out sometimes, so you really gotta, you gotta stock up when you find it. One thing you know, you know we go through a lot of. Toilet paper. Toilet paper. Probably gonna get two of these. You wanna put this in your cart? Or, mm. or under your cart. I got it. Lasts us hopefully for a month. <laughs> we got a lot of butts. A lot of butts need wiping. A lot of butts. Oh my gosh. Eight pounds. About time they got something bigger than three. Nice. Doing it. Yeah. Done. Look what mom got us. Mommy, this is the best time of year. All right, we're all loaded up. I bought you damn much. Loaded down, ready to go. Start of the month. You ready? You ready to see the bus? We are loaded down. Fit all of it in, it's stacked really on to top. Got milks over here under the Target bag. And we're going. 
going home. Okay, so we're home and these are our groceries. I couldn't even uh, fit them all on the counter. Truthfully, some are still in the bag. Um, you saw a lot of what we got in the store. So I'm gonna try to share what I didn't talk about um, in the store. So we got like mixed nuts. We love those. Feta, great for Greek salads. Salsa and hummus are always a must. Trash bags, um, almonds, cheese sticks. No one likes the um, regular cheese sticks and the rest of the kids like the string cheese. Um, Chris snuck these in. These were not a mom approved <laughs> purchase. Lots of lettuce. I eat so many salads. Um, it's truthfully just not even funny how much I eat uh, with the salads. Um, like they're equivalent of like a Nutrigrain bar. Um, fruits and veggies, you saw chips, uh, eggs, we saw that. I got this pasta sauce um, for spaghetti, and I actually get the noodles at Meyer, um, which is a different grocery store, because they have like a chickpea low carb version that we do. Um, we got hot dogs per request of the kids. I got these ones, and then Chris got some other ones and like some brats down there and then we'll get the buns at Meyer also because they have wheat buns. Chris also snuck this in. I can't say I'm super upset about that one though. Um little the little um chocolate chip cookies the kids love these um and honestly once in a while so do I and I like that it doesn't have uh high fructose corn syrup in them. Um more fruit, lots of fruits and veggies. Um, almond milk, oats, we did that. Body armor, we drink this instead of Gatorade now. We love it. Um, I drink it, Chris drinks it, Noah drinks it when he has baseball. Um, we got three loaves of bread, two things of ground beef uh, for tacos. We will typically use two pounds of ground beef. Sushi, Chris and I really like these sushi um, things from Aldi. It's frozen. Um, we cook it, we heat it up, and I know it sounds kind of gross, but it's actually really, really good. We got two of these pizzas, which I should really show you because these are a game changer for us uh, because they're so huge. Like, a normal circle pizza from the store, like, is not going to cut it with everyone that we're feeding. So we get these 16-inch ones from Aldi. And so we got the cheese, and they're big. They're big, y'all. 16 is cheese and pepperoni. And what I do when I cook them is I will take them, like get the wrapper off, and then this cardboard piece underneath, I take it over, okay, and I slide it into the oven and then wiggle the cardboard piece out, um, this thing, and then I stick it back in when the pizza's done and it's like a huge piece of thing. I should probably just buy a pizza, a giant pizza. I don't even know what it's called, pizza spatula. Um, but that's what we do and it works. Um, I got grapefruit. I love to have grapefruit with eggs in the morning for a really healthy breakfast. And then orange juice and yogurt. The kids love these yogurts. I got them these as a surprise. These are the fruit snacks we get. They have no artificial colors, uh, which is important because with Zechariah and some of his stuff, I really, I don't want him having those artificial dyes that have been shown to affect kids more with ADHD and stuff like that. Um, these, we got honey graham cereal. We got like basically honey nut Cheerios and what is this? Honey, basically honey bunches of oats and like life. I got lots of croutons for my salads, and then we got these. These are a new thing. Um, first time I purchased them, kind of just to surprise the kids for an easy little lunch fun thing. So then in the bag, I think it's just more of the same thing, except I got um, this turkey, sliced turkey down there for um, lunches, and then basically their version of wheat thins. And then these, these are really good. I like these a lot. I'll eat them even just plain or on my salad. 
um, or on a sandwich occasionally, but I don't eat a lot of sandwiches. But it's the chunk light tuna, but it's in zesty lemon pepper, and it is really, really, really good. Um, so I get these as like a nice protein thing for lunch, and yeah, so that is it, guys. So all in all, this was quite the haul, even for us. Usually towards the beginning of the month, I will make one really large shopping trip to kind of restock the dry goods um, and replenish everything. Um, and then throughout the month after that, we'll just be buying like produce or things we need for specific dinners and stuff like that. So this was a higher cost, bigger grocery haul. Um, I think on average, we're usually around um, $300 a shopping trip or so. Um, this one being the first one of the month is usually higher and it came in around $450. But yeah, so that's, that's our grocery haul. That's, um, that's it. It was quite the trip today. Uh, overall, the kids hung in there. They did pretty good. So, um, like I said, hopefully we'll have some exciting stuff coming up soon in the near future. So if you'd like to go ahead and subscribe, I would love that. Um, even hitting that notification bell or that thumbs up would be awesome. Uh, love you guys and see you in the next video.